Welcome to the office. <laughs> so I thought we'd do a little rundown of my setup. Since I got the desk, this bad boy here, uh, I did say I'd show you guys my setup for like YouTube and streaming. And yeah, let's take a look. So here is the bad boy setup. It's not the greatest setup, you know, there are better setups out there, but this has took me a very, very long time. This has been about five years in the making. When we started, we had a broken chair, uh, one monitor, and crappy computer, no webcam, uh, like one, no, 0 0.6 upload, and I used to stream on that, obviously we couldn't get HD, it was, uh, it was fucking terrible, but yeah, so we'll, we'll start with the chair, so this chair here, I've had about three years, maybe like two, three years, and it has held up so well, it is the GT Omega, the pillow is, uh, upside down, how did I not notice that? But it's GT Omega, they are a British company. They are Scottish, I believe. This chair was made in Scotland. Give it the old little spin. You know, are you really a gamer? Unless you have a racing chair. But th this chair here is, I was gonna get a DX racer back when I didn't know much about chairs. I think that's the go-to. You're like, oh, to get a DX racer is a thing, right? But I found these guys and they are actually really good. Dare I say better than GT Omega, uh, better than DX Racer. Uh, GT Omega, if you want to pick up one of these chairs yourself, discount code DWO, by the way. And uh, let's move on over to this setup. We'll start with the desk. That is the newest, second newest upgrade, actually. But this desk here, if we press this button, we'll see the magic happen. We head over to here ourselves. This is the newest edition. It might not look that big from here, but this is like an average size monitor. This is my old main monitor. This one here is 32 inches, and I've only just upgraded to more than 60 hertz. This is 144, 32 inch, 144 hertz. And playing games on that, uh, excluding RuneScape, you don't really need high tech for that, but games like Apex and Warzone, like the, the difference, is actually crazy how much better it is on a better monitor. And then we got the second monitor. You know, if you don't have two monitors and a light up keyboard, are you even getting laid, boys? Let's be real. So we head on over to the headphones. These are Nari Ultimates. They're currently in with an AUX, so they're not they're not actually switched on. I'm just lazy with charging them. But the sound quality on these, if you USB them, they've also got a little little mic in there, but I don't think I've ever used it. We use our actual mic, which we'll get to a sec. But the sound quality on these, press the little button here, and out comes a USB. And you just you just plug that into your computer, and then they light up. Then you get the proper quality with a USB. Uh, with the AUX, standard headphones limited by the AUX, but with the USB, especially on shooters and that, you can hear exactly where everyone's coming from. And the bass on them is actually ridiculous. Um, some games which have a lot of sounds, probably not the best for. Um, I've heard they're not good for, oh, what's that game, the shooter one? Um, Overwatch. They're shit for Overwatch, I've heard, because there's just too much sound. But other games, amazing. The mic, which we've had since fuck knows when, the Blue Yeti, I would not recommend a Blue Yeti. Blue Yeti's ideal for podcasts because you can put them on a setting where it takes from both sides and you stick it in the middle of the desk. I think that's what it's designed for. I would not recommend a Blue Yeti. I would like to upgrade from it. It's just kind of a well-known mic, kind of like the, the DX Racer, if you pick up one of them, that most people just go, what do I get? I'll look it up. Blue Yeti, everyone uses them. Um, a good starter mic for the price, but I'd actually advise you get a mic and run it for a mixer, uh, not just a USB mic. The keyboard, as you can see, <laughs> I've had this boy a while. Look at the wear on that. That's, that's a real gamer wear, that is. Um, this is a Black Widow V2 Razor. Um, I haven't had any problems. I had it in probably five years now. It was the first keyboard I ever got when I moved up from the shitty like bass keyboard. And yeah, nothing wrong with it. All the buttons work fine. And yeah, it's just lasted ages. Over here we have the mouse, which I got at the same time is the Def Adder Elite. Two side buttons. I wouldn't mind getting a mouse with a bunch more side buttons at some point. But to be honest, I barely use them. I'd literally use this one. 
I literally use it for, for warding on League. Um, got an overpriced Razor Mouse mat, which you can see starting to bubble up. Had that like five years. I don't even think you need mouse, um, mouse mats, but this is beautiful on the wrist. Uh, we've got a controller, a Steam one. Again, would not recommend, because I don't like this. This is in place of an analog. I'd much rather just have an analog here on the buttons here. This thing for turning your screen on games is fucking annoying. But yes, um, probably give it a go. Some side buttons, it's uh, from Steam. It's all right, does the job. Uh, what have we missed? I got this uh, little monitor stand just to, originally I got it to help the eye level, um, but with the desk, we just press a button, job down, get it to whatever height you want. Um, so what's in the actual computer? Let's uh, give this the old whoop. Oh, there we go, going up. So here is my actual computer. Had this about four years, so a lot of it is dated, but if we take a look inside, the newest edition is the two glow up rams. Are you a gamer if your ram doesn't glow? Um, I actually had to remove one of the fans for it to fit. So if you notice there's only one fan uh, here and there's meant to be two at the top for the uh, cooling for the processor. But we have recently upgraded to 32 RAM. You used to have 16 and I think unless you edit, 16 is fine for literally everything. But when it comes to editing high graphic stuff uh, for my um, odd games I do, which are not RuneScape, it was a bit laggy since I got 32. It's so much better. What have we actually got in there? I can't remember. Um, so we have the Intel Core i7 420 Blazit gigs or gigahertz. And yeah, there's the uh, the banging monitor refresh rate, mate. Best upgrade ever. This is the newest upgrade is the monitor. I uh, bought my girlfriend a computer and it come with it. So I nicked the monitor, give her my old one. And then the desk just before that. And then the, yeah, the graphics card is this one here. GTX 1060, three gigs. That could use upgrading as well at some point. Um, what do I think that, yeah, and the webcam. The webcam is probably the main thing I need to upgrade. It is like 1080, uh, just standard one. If I wanna get do more stuff like this, I'd rather a proper camera. And for making videos with a camera, that webcam's pretty shit. Uh, it's alright for streaming if your webcam's small, uh, but if you want it big, pretty damn naff. Uh, but yeah, I think that is pretty much everything. We got the little light up thingy here that is used for controlling this cheap, like £10 light, which is actually insane. I just drop it on the floor like that, turn it on, and change the colours with this. And then we got these random, like, hand workout knick-knack things um, just for helping your grip all different ones to probably the more common one people have seen Whew. get a good get a good forearm pump with that and we got this one do each and every finger uh, do a lot of um, like pull-ups and things like that lately and it's good to always be working on your grip if you're getting them runescape gains you might as well be getting them IRL gains, but yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it for the for the setup. So, what's your favourite thing Daddy has on, on Daddy's setup? Or well, my big my big telly? Yeah. You like the big screen? That's the new one, isn't it? I love this one. <laughs> Live in them subscribe. All these brothers, my guys, know that they fly, know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my side. CJ Ike, now I got a roll with. Cold, these brothers, my guys, know that they fly.